I had heard of the Dale project in my so early sophomore year. There was kind of talk around campus about this possibility to go and spend a summer in place of choice and do an independent project. I would just recently taken a course in the Astro Department. Uh, one portion of that course was astrophotography and it required us to go out and take photographs of the night sky and something that I hadn't done before. And I'd always had a passion for astronomy and cosmology and I thought that the Dell would be a really neat opportunity at this point in my undergraduate career to take that small section of that course and turn it into a project for myself and go and photograph the night sky in Chile in South America. The highlights of my entire trip down in Chile was actually my third day in the country and had the opportunity to go about 75 miles into the Atacama Desert and I went in there and there was an astronomer who was basically living out in the Atacama Desert. He had a small home that he had built there for himself as well as an observatory. And I went up to the top of the observatory there and it was a new moon meaning there was absolutely no moonlight at all. It was just the, the starlight from the sky above and the professor looked at me and he told me to hold my hand over top of my camera and as I put up my hand up above my camera like this I could actually see the shadow of my own hand on the camera and that shadow was from the light of the Milky Way galaxy and at that point I realized I was standing quite literally in the shadow of the stars uh, which was <laughs> quite a wild experience. Well, I think a lot of the time it's easy to be intimidated and challenged in ways by the universe as we're familiar with it and that really shakes our sense of place a lot of the time and we struggle to kind of root ourselves uh, here on planet Earth when we're standing beside something that's, or beneath something that's truly so, so vast. And so what the trip really allowed me to do is to grow closer uh, to the stars in a certain way um, through photographing them and learning about them to kind of realize my own connection as being an earthly inhabitant but also one uh, of the skies. One of the great things about the project, specifically with astrophotography, is that it was very interdisciplinary in a sense. It forced me to consider, as does the liberal arts education here at Princeton, connections across varying academic disciplines that you might not see going in. And so the fact that philosophy blends in with astronomy and there's this artistic component in the actual photography itself um, is, is fascinating that one can, one can realize the true value and not tying themselves down to one specific area of interest, but rather forcing themselves to see the connections between them. If there was any sophomore that was uncertain or perhaps a little hesitant to apply for the Dale, I would encourage it on all regards. It's truly a very unique opportunity to not only get out there and explore your interests further, but to really challenge yourself um, in having eight weeks and being in a place that you're completely unfamiliar with and start asking questions that you really otherwise wouldn't and putting yourself in a brand new environment, in the case of mine, being <laughs> tossed out into the desert and laying beneath the stars and forced to ask questions that otherwise wouldn't.